Hello and welcome to my Audi e-tron GT plasticity tutorial. This is more of an experiment. I will try to show all the steps and explain all relevant aspects. This is the next part of the tutorial. I will publish this tutorial, which is expected to take 6-10 hours every 3-5 to five days or weekly in 30 minute blocks on Patreon. I will publish the first 10 minutes of each 30 minute block as an advertisement on YouTube. This way you'll know when the next 30 minute block is available on Patreon. So if you missed 20 minutes of the last part here on YouTube, visit Patreon. This is an exception because I use audio, I find the text and AI synchronization very time consuming. I have no idea how others do it, so I'm trying to offset the effort through Patreon. I can't explain every small step, however, as many steps become repetitive over time. However, with time and practice, everyone will understand what I'm doing here for 6 to 10 hours. On my Patreon, you can find the construction plans and the plasticity 3D data with the current state of the modeling progress. Prepare some patches for better transitions. No, this is a very complex part because I don't know the actual spacing between the real sheets. My strategy is to block out with Xnerbs patches. Um, I later relax these sometimes tight looking patches with squares to get cleaner input for new Xnerbs, and then adjust this again at the end with square single span patches. This process can take much time, but this is car modeling without scan references.
Now some fast X Nerbs patch blends. Relax the blends with squares. I optimize some patches for cleaner transitions now.
Now it's time to say goodbye to the YouTube portion. The following 20 minutes say, Chain, Hamoin 20 minutes, the entire 30 minute block, are available exclusively on Patreon. The next 10 minutes block on YouTube begin with the final minute of the Patreon version. Thanks for watching. See you on Patreon.